Well, we're shifting our attention to the other big update that is coming in from West Bengal now. Amidst the heat on the Mamta Banerjee-led government, especially post the SSC scam arrest of former Minister Partha Chatterjee, Mamta Banerjee is all set to reshuffle the cabinet on Wednesday at 4 p.m. What she's saying, though, is that there will not just be, of course, someone new who will take over the portfolio of education from Partha Chatterjee. As of now, Mamta Banerjee has taken temporary charge of uh, that portfolio after the, part, the government had decided to sack Partha Chatterjee as the minister. And, of course, the party subsequently suspended him from the primary membership as well. But it seems that Mamta Banerjee is also suggesting that there will be some other concern changes as well. There will be an attempt to bring in some fresh faces is what we are hearing as far as this impending cabinet reshuffle is concerned. Mamta Banerjee is likely to bring in fresh faces into the new cabinet including women leaders. My colleague Shagada Mukhapadhyay is also joining us with more on this. So, uh, this opportunity, Shagata, of uh, you know deciding exactly who takes forward from Partha is also being looked at as some uh, you know rejig of sorts by Mamta Banerjee in the cap uh, in the cabinet. Well, most certainly, um, Shivani, it seems that uh, the uh, the opportunity uh, or uh, you know the, the 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 situation that the the Trinamool Congress government finds itself in after. Uh, Mamata, after uh, you know, Partha Chatterjee was uh, was taken into custody. It seems that Mamata Banerjee has used that as an opportunity uh, to to make a, a major reshuffle mm. in not only the government but also within the party. There are two sets of rejects okay. that have been announced today. Uh, one uh, one where Mamata Banerjee has uh, has already announced that the cabinet reshuffle would be announced on Wednesday at 4 p.m where she had said that she would bring in several new faces including uh, uh, you know uh, uh, you know some some people who uh, who were in the organization uh, would be brought into the uh, into the cabinet whereas mm. some four to five uh, uh, you know faces uh, or rather leaders who were in the cabinet uh, serving the government will now be um, asked to serve the organisation. So that's a that's a major uh, reshuffle. So, Shagata, then, why uh, this you know, why this decision? Has there been some other discontent also brewing as far as the cabinet is concerned? Because this is a fairly new government. Well, you see, uh, most of these leaders uh, who have been in Mamata Banerjee's cabinet are old timers. Uh, the uh, although this. This particular cabinet is a new one, mm. uh, but the government, the Mamata Banerjee government, is being has been in power uh, in Bengal since 2011. So that's uh, like 11 years already. And and some and, and most of these leaders, most of these cabinet uh, ministers, are old timers in the Mamata Banerjee administration. Obviously, in the wake of the of the fact that uh, serious corruption charges have been levelled against uh, the you know some of these leaders, uh, one of whom uh, is already in. In, in uh, enforcement directed uh, directorate custody, Mamata Banerjee finds this as an opportune moment uh, to to to, ma to make uh, or, or or bring about a major overhaul in the in the cabinet itself. So we'll be uh, we'll be very interested to see exactly which are these five six faces which are who are brought in the cabinet and who are the four to five faces who are actually taken out and asked to do organisational work. So that would be a major overhaul mm -hmm. as far as the government is. Concern. But that's not all, Shivani. The uh, the, the the Trinamool Congress Party hmm. has also uh, uh, brought about a, a major uh, reject in the organization, in the district level. And, and there have been several changes in leadership in districts like Kuchbihar, in districts like Hooghly, not 24 Parganas, West Bardwan. Some of these uh, districts have been, uh, you know, uh, thoroughly leadership have been uh, entirely uh, changed. Okay. Uh, you know, uh, Shagata, just hold Mithapur. on with me. I just want to quickly go across to the BJP's Dilip Ghosh, who's also joining us. Dilip Ghosh, the news is that Mamta Banerjee is going to reshuffle in his cabinet in reshuffle, reject type on Wednesday. उन्होंने अनाउंस किया है पांच छह नए फेसेस वो कह रहे हैं वो अपने कैबिनेट में लेके आएंगे आपका पहला रिस्पांस देखिए कई दिन से इसकी चर्चा चल रही थी कि मंत्री बुटल डिसेबल होगा एक दो और भी मंत्री है जिनका जिनके बारे में शक है जिनका पासवन स्टिक नहीं है उसमें परिषद अधिकारी जो आ सकते हैं जो अभी शिक्षा उप मंत्री है तो ये स्वाभाविक है लोग भी चर्चा कर रहे थे और करना ही पड़ेगा नहीं तो और डावाडोल हो जाएगा मंत्रिमंडल 
क्या आप ये कह रहे हैं कि ये एक एक ऐसी एक्सरसाइज है जिसमें कैबिनेट को बचाने की कोशिश की जा रही है कि अगर बाकी भी कुछ ऐसे लोग हैं जिनके ऊपर एलिगेशन है या इन्वेस्टिगेशन हो सकती है उनको पहले से निकालने की कोशिश हो रही है दोनों तरफ है जिस प्रकार परिस्थिति बनी हुई है मंगाल में सरकार की तरफ टारगेट कर रहे हैं जो विपक्ष के लोग सामान्य लोगों का भरोसा टूट गया है पार्टी का भी मोनाबोल बहुत नीचे आ गया है तो इस समय उनको वो भी जानते हैं कुछ लोग उसे लपेटे में आ सकते हैं मुझे लगता है उनको भी अब बाहर करेंगे कोई नए लोगों को मौका देंगे कि जो बाहर भी जिनके मन में असंतोष है वो भी खुशी हो जाएंगे जी दिलीप घोष जी फाइनल एक सवाल आपसे आप ये जो एसएससी स्कैम का जो मुद्दा है बीजेपी कैसे आ, इसको बंगाल में और आगे लेके जाएगी क्योंकि ममता बनर्जी का कहना है टीएमसी का कहना है कि उन्होंने कर दिया है जो उनको करना था इस केस में नहीं इतनी बड़ी स्कैम हुई है और बहुत लोग इसमें जुड़े हुए ये तो एकदम लूट मारा मार, मार चुके थे वहां लूट मार हो रहा था पार्टी जानती है सब जानते हैं गाँव गाँव से लोगों से पैसा उठा कर ले गए हैं जितनी नौकरियां मिली है लोगों को नौकरी ज्वाइन किए और तरह ऐसे हैं जो फेल किए हुए जितना जो लिस्ट आया है सब जानते हैं okay. और कौन किया कैसे किया इसका पूरा हो जाएगा इनको तब पता चलेगा महोत्तर जी आपकी सरकार और पार्टी बचने में लगी थे जी दिलीप घोषी थैंक्स लॉट फॉर स्पीकिंग टू अस